everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome to today's video. So before I start, I just want to apologise for not putting a video up on Wednesday. Um, as you've probably seen from my YouTube posts, I've been really suffering, I'm still suffering um, with my sinuses. So I, excuse me, but I sound really, really blocked up. Um, yeah, I've got polyps um, up both nostrils, but my left nostril is completely blocked, but it is just running all the time. It's like dripping like a tap and it's just been getting me down a bit and just making me feel like rubbish. So, um, yeah, so I do apologise for missing my video on Wednesday and I'd also like to say thank you for all your lovely um, messages saying that I hope I, uh, hope I feel better soon. Um, yeah, thank you so, so much for all those as well. So today's video is a little bit of a mixture. Um, I'm going to take you to Asda with me. I went and I filmed what um, was new in uh, or what my favourite bits were in home wear and also in fashion, ladies fashion. I'm also going to be decorating the house up for Easter as well. Um, so if that is something you would like to see, then grab your drinks and your snacks. And I've got my um, Hello Spring mug. It's things like this that cheer me up as well. Silly little things. Uh, but yeah, I absolutely love this mug. You might have seen this in a B&M haul a couple of weeks back. Um, yeah, it cost about £4, I think. But how cute is it with the little bunny on? Yeah, small things, you know. They just make you, they just cheer you up really, don't they? If you're feeling a bit, mm, <laughs> a, bit mm, <laughs> a bit fed up. Um, and I'd also like to say thank you to everybody who wished Harvey a happy birthday. We had a lovely weekend last weekend um, when he came home for the weekend. For anybody who is new here and doesn't know, uh, we've got a son and a daughter. Harvey who is now 20 and Kaya who is 16. So it was Harvey's birthday on Leap Day. He was actually born on 29th of February. So yeah, he was 20 on the 29th of Feb. And we had a lovely birthday meal and he came home from uni just for the weekend. So it was really nice to have quality time together, um, just the four of us, some nice family time. Um, so, right, let me crack on then. So let me take a sip of my coffee. And talking of things that just cheer me up as well, I've got an absolutely fantastic bra to share with you that has been kindly sent to me by Magic Bra. So... Let me put my coffee down and I'll share this with you. So they have sent me this beautiful black bra. So the company is Magic Bra, like I say. And they have sent me this. Now this is called the Magic Front Closure Seamless Push-Up Bra. Obviously it's in black and it feels such nice quality. It's so smooth. It's got the really thick, stretchy, uh, wide straps. So it's a, um, as, a, as I said, it is a front closure one. So it fastens up the front. I will insert um, a, a clip here of um, their website because they sell so many things on their website, all different types of bras. Every design, every style, lots of choices, lots of different colours. They sell seam free, push up, front closure ones, stick on ones, sports bra. So a, a different uh, style to suit every taste. So I'm going to go and try this on for you to see how it fits. And if you would like to order any order anything from Magic Bra, they have kindly gave me a discount code. So the code is Emma20. You can get 20% off your entire order. And they say that all their um, bras are suitable for machine washable except the stick-ons. So the stick-on bras, they recommend a hand wash, but all their other bras are machine washable, but they do recommend a cold wash. So like I say, lots of different styles on their website. So I'm going to go and try this one on so we can have a see how it fits and I can let you, let you know how it fits and how it feels. 
So I'm really pleased with this bra. Um, I think it looks nice. It makes my boobs look um, okay. Um, I really like the thick wide strap. It's really comfortable. It's easy to wear. It's easy to um, put on because of the front fastening. I also like the back. It hides some of the back fat. So I think it's quite flattering as well. Really comfortable. And um, it, I think these are really good um, quality for affordable prices as well because i just think you know you want nice quality but you don't want to pay the earth for it and this feels really nice um but yeah like i say really affordable prices as well i also love the fact that it's seamless and it also feels really supportive which obviously we need that in a bra as well so yeah thumbs up from me Thank you to Magic Bra for sending me um, the front fastening seamless bra. I absolutely love it. And if you want to order anything off their website, I will add the link to their website in the description box below. I will also add my discount code EMMA20 for 20% off your order. Now we'll get on with the next part of the video. So I'm going to show you the Easter Decorate With Me next. And then after that, at the end of the video, it will be the Asda Come Shop. So let's trim up the house now for Easter. These are all the decorations that I'm going to be putting out today. So some of these are new that I've bought this year and most of them are what I have bought in previous years. I always like to buy a couple of new bits each year but also obviously you've got to reuse what you've already got as well. A heart's beat to the city streets we begin to feel the fire We rise like tall buildings As the chemicals they take us higher The night's young and it's just begun As she puts her hand in mine We want to chase the night These are the glass egg jars from Home Bargains. I got them last year, but I have seen them in again this year. The plate was from Poundland last year, and all the sweets and chocolate were from Home Bargains. tea towel is from a set of three which I bought from B&M this year and the matching oven gloves obviously are also from B&M. I think they look so pretty, so nice for spring.
bunny is from Home Bargains this year. It was three ninety nine. It's called Sadie the Bunny. And then over the other side of the fireplace, I'm going to put um, the new wooden bunny that I got from um, Poundland. This one was six pounds, and I think it's so nice. It's really large, as you can see. So I think I'm just going to stand it up on the floor, and it matches the sideboard, the furniture that we've got in our living room as well. So I'm really pleased with that one. Last piece of Easter decor is the wreath. We always put our wreath on the gate outside and there are so many nice Easter wreaths this year. Um, some in home bargains and also a lot in home scents. Right, so the next part of the video is going to be having a good look around Asda. So we're going to start off with the ladies fashion and I'm just going to pick out some of my favourite pieces that I saw in store today. So I like the black dress for £18 and it was also in rust colour. And then I really like this co-ord set, navy and white stripe, £12.50 for the top and then it had a matching long skirt for £12.50 as well. I really like these trousers for £16 and they had that pattern in a few different things but I really like the trousers, they felt really nice material and then this vest top £7 and then this was the same sort of pattern but in a shirt, lots of black and white things in there today have this studio edit range and how nice is this spiker jacket for £45 it looks such good quality I think it looks really expensive and then they have this jumper with the collar and the v-neck available both ways round with the black and white stripes that was nice I thought as well and that was £30 so a little bit more expensive I thought for that and then they had this again black and white in this studio edit but it was really nice £30 with the nice pocket detailing on and then another shirt here black and white again you might have guessed for £20 Then moving on to the swimwear, they always have nice swimwear I think in Asda but in Tesco's they do as well. So they had this animal print uh, bikini, £5.50 uh, for the top and then this one as well, the black and white one, I thought that one was nice. And they do quite a lot of the patterns in like the bikinis and the swimming costumes like most of them do. They also have this shaping one in black, thought that one was nice. And they had some um, with like the little skirts around the bottom as well, bikini, swimming costumes, so something for everybody. The shirts were £10 and they were available in black and white, but they did have some cerise ones as well, which I think I'll show you later. So now we're moving on to the Billy Fires range and I'm just having a look to see what I like in this range. I thought this jumper was nice, £28. I like the detailing on the sleeves there. And then they had this black one with the gold detailing on the neck, like the little badge, black uh, polo neck jumper. Then they had this long beige uh, tight fitting or, or sort of um, figure fitting, £18 for the long dress with the buttons. The top 10, they did feel really nice quality and um, that's just a polo neck jumper I think again. And then they had this um, padded um, puffer jacket and it had this like matching scarf, £45. I'm not sure whether I like the scarf but I quite like the jacket.
losing time, I'm fading fast I just wanna make it last Try to let go of the past I close my eyes, embrace the blast Sleepless nights and headaches stack Restlessness to hell and back What's my purpose, what do I grab? A slippery surface, a heart attack And sometimes you just gotta believe There's something Moving on to the homeware section now. So I'm starting off with the Stacey Solomon range. She's got some lovely bits in. Really like this uh, bathroom set that she's got in. Uh, then she's got some really nice throws, cushions, bedding, some really nice spring ones. She's even got towels as well, hand towels, bath towels. And they look really nice, I think. Also in the Stacey Solomon range, she has got lots of nice bits for Easter. So if you want to decorate up for Easter, definitely worth checking out um, her section. She's got a bag of the decorative Easter eggs. I think they're really nice. I love this pack of three bunny ornaments for £9. Don't think they was a, ba a bad price to say you've got three in there. She's even got these egg cozies. How cute. They were £6 for the pack. And she had some hanging um, egg decorations. They were four pounds for the pack of four. They're really cute as well. And she had some nice napkins and tablecloths as well. Really like this egg tree, but this was a little bit more expensive at 20 pounds, but it is really nice. And then how cute, 10 pounds for this bunny cushion really nice and a nice neutral colour as well and even had the fluffy tail on the back thought that was really cute those are the um, napkins and the placemats they had them in lilac and also in beige with the frilled edge and how cute is this mug you guys know I love a mug but I really don't need any more so I didn't buy it but really nice for four pounds five pounds for the bunny string lights they look really cute as well and then I've noticed a few places are doing these napkin rings. I think the White Company are doing them, but a lot more expensive than these ones in the uh, Stacey range. And then the Hello Spring sign, that was only £4. And she's even got cutlery and some bunny bowls, pasta bowls as well. Wine glasses, bunny cushion as well there on the bottom. And you can even get the whole dining set for £24. Something from nothing. 
some really nice gardening things in Asda, the gardening tool sets and the gloves in the beautiful floral pattern. They also had that same pattern in plant pots and the ones with the hedgehogs on the side. I was really impressed by how much gardening things um, they had in there. So many plant pots and some really different unusual things as well and not bad prices. So if you were wanting to um, decorate up your garden then definitely worth having a look in there look at the Bentley the cockapoo for 12 pounds how cute So I've just got back from Asda, so I'm just going to share with you what I got. So not a lot. If you can hear that noise in the background, I hope you can hear me okay. We're having um, the carpet cleaned. So I've shut the door, but obviously you can still hear the um, machinery. So I hope you can hear me. So I didn't get much, just picked up a few food bits. I was very good. I didn't buy um, any homeware or any clothes. So I picked up some salted peanuts for Richard Day was 54 pence. Picked up two um, packs of ham. These were two for three pounds. So cured ham on the bone and oven baked dry cured ham. Then I got the big dairy milk chunky ultimate egg. This was 10 pounds, so it's not cheap, but it's a big one. And it's the chunky one, which I absolutely love. I had this one last year. And I can have this because dairy milk is usually a may contain gluten, but this isn't. So with being celiac, I can have that. So I've treated myself to that for Easter. Then picked up four of these little Easter eggs. These were only 60 pence each. I picked up the uh, dairy milk buttons for exactly the same, but they did also have the white buttons and also the Freddos for only 60 pence. I mean, they're only the little ones, but yeah, they're on offer at the minute at 60 pence. Richard wanted some cans of San Miguel. So you've got six there. The only small ones though, smaller ones. They were 6.25, I think. Then my mum wanted me to pick up um, some jam and cream donuts for her and they were uh, 69 pence and then i picked up two of the sandwich fillers i think these are one pound 85 each or two for three pounds i got the same one is for my mom and one is for us they do loads of sandwich fillers in there um seafood cocktail and chicken and bacon chicken tikka spicy chicken then cheese and onion, egg, tuna, loads of sandwich fillers, never seen so many. <laughs> so picked up those two for three pounds. nearly forgot to show you these two frozen items that I got from the frozen free from section. 
the gluten-free curly fries were £1.80 and the gluten-free onion rings were £2.40 I think and they were free from gluten and milk as well. Um, the big Asda that I went to had quite a lot in the gluten-free frozen section so if you are wanting gluten-free if you've got a big Asda near you definitely worth checking it out. And then Bentley came to have a look to see what shopping we'd got in case he'd got any treats. You haven't got any today. I'll get you one out in a minute. That's it for today's video. I really hope you have enjoyed watching. If you want to ask me any questions, please forward them in the comments box uh, below the video. Uh, because I am going to try and film um, a Q&A video. So I asked for questions on Instagram and I received a few over on there. So if you would like to... Ask me any questions you like. I will answer most things um, about house or family or YouTube or I don't know, anything you like. Um, please pop them below and then hopefully I'll have enough um, questions to film a Q&A video for you. And as always, put any other video ideas forward below as well. I always try and film what you have requested. So that's it. Thank you to Magic Bra for sending me the beautiful bra and click on the link if you want to have a look at their website. And don't forget to use the code EMMA20 and I will see you all very soon in my next video. Take care of yourselves. Bye.